Fair deal. Quite a nest. Souvenirs? Most of them were gifts. Little mementos from my appreciative and loyal followers. A nice warm stove, for instance, from the town hall in Watson's Junction. This, a gift from the Royal Hotel in Emmitsville. Levinson's Emporium in Sedania. Those are from the library in Morgantown. Make yourself at home. Well, I don't know as I can. Not around all these books. They frighten you? Always get scared of something knows more than I do. Wine? Whiskey. That's right, you said you'd never touch the stuff. I may have to see that you cultivate a taste for the finer things. To the future. That Napoleon fellow, he drank wine too? He had his own vineyards. You a fellow once, colonel down in Mexico during the war. Had an idea he was some sort of Roman king. Called himself Alexander the Great. He was a Greek. Poor fellow, they had to tie him up and take him away. I'm not sure I like what you're saying. Mr. Darcy, I don't know a lot about history, but I do know this. A lot of men have tried to take a lot of places all for themselves, even in this country. They never make it. That's because they never learn. Learn? You can't do it alone. You have to have the people with you. Take that little Frenchman. He came close. Paris, Moscow. He had to get from here to here. You know why he failed? Two reasons. Broken supply lines and the people hated him. Oh, he got to Moscow all right. But when he did, the people were gone and the place was on fire. On the way back in the snow, he lost an army and he lost the world. So you take the little towns. One by one. And you get the people to like you. That's right. Also one by one? No. No, they come around real fast. You see, I always make sure they need me. Before I come into a town, it's hit and hit hard by the Missouri Redlegs. I make sure of that, too, because those Missouri Redlegs are my own men wearing different outfits. When I move in with my Jayhawkers the next day, I'm a big, strong daddy come to protect them against the nasty raiders. And believe me, I don't have to take their towns from them. They hand them to me. Sounds like nothing's going to stop you. That's right. I'll take town after town after town across the territory until I take the big one. Take Abilene, you take the railroad. Take the railroad, you take Kansas. Any questions? Taking Kansas is one thing, holding it's another. Oh, I'll hold it. I'll hold it with guns and men. Big guns and trained men. I'll train the men and I'll buy guns. Enough of them to keep anyone from taking my country from me. Sounds like you got it all figured out, Mr. Darcy. Only one thing bothers me. Seems like an awful lot of innocent people might get themselves hurt. That happens, Bleak. If you think I like that part of it, I don't. But this is a war I'm fighting. Wars have their victims, their martyrs, their unpleasant necessities. But let me tell you this, before I'm through, I'm gonna give the people of Kansas a fine big country of their own, with as rich a life as any place on Earth. As long as they live it your way. Kinda wish you'd make that our way. Our way, Darcy. <laughs>